You know what's scary? What's going on? Oh, sh let's get right into the show, yo. What's up, my guys? What's up? What's up, my ladies? What's up, what's up? boy, Crispy? We got Ozzy G on the other side. Frank J yeah. in the place. This is Irrational Therapy. How my fellas doing today? Everything good, hood, like everything should be. Got his new camera, making my fucking hair look. Crispy. <laughs> Wild, nigga. I need a fucking haircut. You need a comb, my G. And your hair is not even going. Look, it's red and shit. I don't know y'all can see it, but it's red all over. Oh, it is red. I don't fucking know. Like, I ain't got no like give you a kiss before the show happened or what? I got red hair, bro. Ah. I'm a redhead. Nah, he's been That's listening to a whole lot of red. Yeah. Cool. Nah, when you were gone, Frankie Frankie was on Playboy Cardi's dick. I was like, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. On the dick. Nice. You know what came with my memories today on Facebook? Hmm. Four years ago, can you guess? Hmm. Can you guess? No. Kendrick Lamar damn tour. You win, right? Hell yeah, that's what just came about my memories. Dang, you went to the last Kendrick show? I guess, yeah, I guess Dang. so, bro. I guess so. <laughs> Four years ago, dog. Nah, I that was is like, crazy. fuck. It didn't seem that long, but it's it's been a while. I I don't yeah, think four years I don't is think, a long time. I don't think he's coming back. Now, man, you've been saying his album gonna drop every week since <laughs> nah. episode like twenty. He's starting, yeah. he's starting to lose his belief. Yeah, I, nah. I've been trying to tell him for months now, dog. And now dropping. he's finally listening. He ain't dropping, bro. He ain't dropping. No, he done. Chris. He done. He can't, bro. He like he physically can't. I wish. I wish my artist. What if like your he, artist? Like, who? <laughs> Like who? Him, bro, I know I stack with fucking heat. Everything he drops is just some fire. I Everything, I bro. It. You know, I seen <clears> this <throat> one thing that they compared the producer that that was on. I can't feel my face. Blinding lights. Um, he he, he was on a bunch of the weekend singles. Uh -huh. They're comparing that street to. Quincy Jones and Michael Jackson. So it's funny that you bring Michael Jackson up in this conversation because people nowadays will say and consider he is the modern day Michael Jackson. Right. All right. So the new song that just came out, uh huh. Take My Breath. Uh huh. If you listen to it closely, you'll hear a sample of the thriller beat inside of there. Mm. Yeah. Sh shall we, shall we listen? listen? Shall we take Did a we listen? listen to yeah. Yeah, but did y'all hear the fucking? I, I said it. Nah, I didn't hear. Let me let, let me take a peek. Let me yeah, take go, go let me back, take bro. a peek. Let me take a peek. Let me take a peek. Let me take a peek. Go ninja, go ninja, go. go I just ninja, think uh, go, the weekend's the best go. thing going right now, bro. Everything he's dropping is just some super fire, and it's not like he needs a fucking you know like a group collab or like a. A whole alter ego and uh you know a group with him to make a fire song You're like right. your boy like your boy bruno hey, he although lying. i am ready for that silk sonic shit. I, I i think the weekend will get to there uh get to that point eventually if he like, falls if he starts falling out i wouldn't doubt it right because bruno I, stopped making music and then he's like i need to do something and then yeah. he found that nigga he found a the dude from Black Eyed Peas. How about we just play the instrumental? Sure, bro. Whatever you want to do, you know, you know, whatever you want to do, you you the producer, bro. Well, oh, like you play, produce your own song right now. I just don't know how accurate the beat will be on an instrumental. You know, sometimes well, it, they have it changed and shit. Sometimes they speed it, it up it's straight from uh, <clears throat> from the weekend's website. I bought it. <clears throat> you bought it. Ah, ah. And then hear the thriller. Close the bed. Hmm. Interesting, right? You got to go to when Michael Jackson's dance. Like he does the zombie dance when he turns into a zombie. That whole little rift where it's just instrumental. He's not singing. And he's he's got the whole singing. instrumental on his on his uh, DJ thing, bro. Yeah. I don't know how far it, it goes into. The Chris song. is uh, pretty like, official. How long is the song? Like eight minutes. Chris, Chris got all the yeah, Chris got the whole instrumental, bro, of every song. I do everything. 
because of that uh, DJ thing. That's just super fire. Actually, no. I, I'm on Apple Music. Damn. I wish I, I had know. Apple Music. Uh, you should just say yes so you can sound cool. Stop being so lame. I, bro, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm an honest person. I'm an honest person. And like oh, people oh, say, shit. people say why I'm, too, why I'm honest. You know why I tell them I'm too voice. honest? Musically, do you think the weekend is surpassed MJ or I'll speak by this week. next album goes? Yeah, I'm gonna speak by for sure, bro. I, I I rock with the weekend. You already know how to do. <laughs> I think he's the best to do it. But Michael Jackson, I, I would say Michael Jackson probably is one of his biggest influencers. And I do like Michael Jackson too, but I rather like if you put like a Michael Jackson album in front of me and the Weekend album, I'm gonna pick the Weekend for sure. You know, like I, I read this quote somewhere I forgot where, but they were saying something that like my, like there's gonna be an original art form, and then there's gonna be people that are inspired by that art form, and that art form is just gonna get kind of uh wiped out eventually and like there's gonna be what M- I, I probably mj got it from somewhere else but from yeah, mj you know the, the the weekend's gonna get it and then from the weekend somebody yeah. else is gonna get it and then it's just gonna evolve to something else but completely different yeah because like, a lot of kids like that listen to the weekend like ozzy didn't know who M- michael jackson was until a while ago you know what i'm saying mm-hmm you know, the weekends covered Dirty Diana, you know, so that's a yeah. Popularity wise, I don't think he's there yet, but musically he's he's getting there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. How about how about you, Frankie? What what do you think? Of the weekend? Yeah, his progression to surpass uh MJ. He's pop, right? He is uh considered pop. Yeah. Oh, that, isn't that what pop. Jackson was pop. R&B, pop, soul type shit, I guess. And and Michael Jackson was R&B as well, too, sometimes. Mm. I think he's on the right track to be, like, uh, they're similar in, like, their generation. They're, the, they're that star in each mm-hmm. their generation. So, like, The weekend, I could see him, yeah, be, like, the next Michael Jackson, next king of pop, Torch Past. Yo. Yo. Don't get mad at me, yo. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look at me with the four yeah, five on, bro. All the crazy shit I did to die. Those will be the best memories. <laughs> I just want to let it go for the night. Yeah. That would be the best therapy for me. All hey. the crazy shit hey. I did tonight. <laughs> Those would be the best <laughs> therapy for me. I just want to let it go for the night. That would be the best therapy for me. Hey, yeah. hey, hey. <laughs> Banana liquor. 
Jamaican shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. We can just drink Alex. anything, yo. Everything. <laughs> Fucking hat went around everywhere. Uh, Look good. at the camera. <laughs> oh, that hat did go everywhere, huh? Hell yeah, dog. All the horses love that hat. That, that, that was some good times, y'all. Mm. I'm learning how to choose the right audio apps for you. Which one? <laughs> um, no, <nah>, yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> Frankie. Three, my lord. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie, that, like, for some reason, we had... I don't know whose camera it was. Do you remember whose camera it was? That, oh, no, that black, like, it was like a flip flip it camera or yeah, what? With the, with the thing. It was know. weird. And, uh, yeah, we used to just record random ass moments. And that was like 10% of what went on in that house. Not even 10%. Like, in that house, we're talking about a house in Lizard City. And, like pretty old yellow house we call it the yellow house infamous yellow house so mm. you remember when it, it we seen some ghosts in there yo mm-hmm. remember them that, that ghost yep. like i was making a beat or whatnot I, uh ozzy was working i was like yo check out this beat i fucking made or something like that i ended up recording it back when i couldn't sync it to my phone or whatnot i was recording it from the speakers Sent him the B and he was like, yo, who the fuck talking in the background or what's that noise? Or you said something like that, right? <laughs> yeah. And, and then I was like, what are you talking about? I, like, I made sure all the fans were off. I made sure everything was off. Like, I don't know what you're talking about. And then I looked back at it and then it was like, yeah, there was like some whispers and some like screaming, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was weird. It was weird, dog. And that shit, but never forget that shit. That that was that was just a little moment, like uh, so much shit in that fucking house, shit yeah. that we can't even talk about. But yeah, I, I, I ended up coming across that that video like a few days ago. I totally forgot I had it in my other YouTube. And I was like, yo, <laughs> that shit would be hilarious. I'd have cut out a few a few scenes that were in there, but oh, fucking yeah. yellow house, nigga. Oh, we watch the explicit version after. No, mm. no, no, no. That that was mainly the explicit, but yeah, people, he cut it like that when he made people, video. He made it like that. Some people had to. Uh, some people had to get cut out. <laughs> oh man, are you familiar with American Idol? Yeah, everybody know American Idol. I don't watch it though. Yeah, you know, <coughs> you know Saisha Mercado. No, negative. You know what? I, I ain't even gonna get into this. It's gonna be. It's gonna be a good episode today. It's gonna be a good episode today. <laughs> this bitch got. Yeah, this bitch got her her newborn baby taken away for the second time, and because the first time the first kid got malnourished, the doctor was like this. Baby mount nervous. You ain't taking care of this baby. Got to get the baby taken away. And then the second one, she was improved to get this baby. Ended up having this baby anyways. Now the baby getting taken away. Damn, Let's have a good just, episode. That sucks. So we got a, tax, a child tax credit coming out. The mm. child tax credit for kids under six. You get three. That shit came out already, bro. Yeah, you, I know, you, I know. We late. This is like three weeks late. Nah, this is a non-parental channel, bro. Like, pe- people are... Did you know that, Frankie? Nah, that's what I'm saying, dog. We got to tell the youth about this. That way... Oh, they, oh they, I was like... They, I was a kid. They, they could jump on this, on this trend. So, yeah. motherfuckers... Yeah. Uh, motherfuckers, motherfuckers who got kids, it ain't, you know what I'm talking about? They get that money, you know what I'm saying? So what the ages is, it's so three hundred. 
Under six, you're getting three hundred. Between seven and seventeen, you're getting two fifty. Well, is this monthly? Year, yeah, every month. Hmm. Until when? Last month. Infinite. Until the end of the year. Oh, it's just this year. Yeah, it's just this year. Until just they renew until, it. Until infinity. <laughs> until oh, wish, <laughs> <nigga>. <laughs> That's kind of. You thought he was about to help everybody come up. <laughs> It's no, right. it, 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 yeah, it, you know it helps, I guess. I should say this for investment of the week, <laughs> but nah. <laughs> I'm what gonna have a kid, nigga? Nah, you ain't gonna have it in time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's for the shit that happened last year. You get a good two months. It's like nah, it's from last year. COVID, you gotta have a, you, gotta, you gotta have a kid on uh, your taxes from last year. No, nah, they said the same thing about about unemployment. And then they ended up backing that shit up, backing that shit up. They might be the same thing with this one. What? I wouldn't lose hope. It's 2020 taxes. If you have a dependent on your 2020 taxes, kids mm-hmm. on your 2020 taxes, you right, get the right, money. right, right. You don't got to sign up or nothing like that. If you had kids on your 2020 taxes, you're getting the money. There's right. nothing you, you don't have to call nobody or nothing. That, that your money just pops up in your account. Like, yeah. That they're going to take later from you. Yeah. You think? Out of your taxes. No, this is a not not this one. Not this. Not for the kids. Yeah, this is like this, a similar this is the check. money. This is the money that they should have sent you from your taxes. Yeah, they sent me. They sent me some paper. Well, hell yeah, I fold it. I fold it. Again. Give it the money. Okay. Uh, okay. You're, you're like you like you were in the what the one like six range. Who? Oh yeah. Lazi, one to six. How old is Lazi? Eight. He'd be eight this year, and then Zeke's one. Oh, so he falls in the other one, right? The other yeah. You let Sleepy Joe sniff uh, Lil Ozzy's hair? I don't know that nigga. He ain't coming around here. <laughs> you don't like yeah. him that much, huh? Yeah, no, I buzz that in his mouth. <laughs> so Fuck that nigga, dog. And a I weird guy. Too. Just like sniffing little kid's hair. Um, <laughs> Presidents. That's what you're going to do. Presidents. <laughs> the last one was trying to grab people's pussies and shit. And everybody loved that. I mean, uh, that's cool. Shit? I don't know. That's I weird. So. Apparently, Trump got something right, though, that the Wuhan virus came from Wuhan and it's a, a lab leak and whatnot. And Trump was trying to say it before. That's the only thing he got right, basically. And fuck Trump, nigga, and all his fucking followers still. Dang. Steel, nigga, shit. That's right. Steel, Steel. and not like the brand. Uh, No, but Free Britney, the movement. No, no, no. The Free Free Britney bitch movement is finally to an end. And to our number one supporter, Frankie's going to take over this story. (laughs) Oh, for real? We weren't talking (laughs) about it. Don't you love Britney? No, I was just saying, yeah, the... uh, Finally, the she can start making her own decisions. Her dad, you know, her dad was paying himself uh, sixteen thousand a month uh, for taking care of all her stuff of her like sixty million dollar estate or whatever. I heard that she was getting one percent of her revenue. She was like, yeah, like one point three percent, and he was getting everything. Damn. And he was getting sixteen a, a month, bro. Sixteen k mm-hmm. a month just for doing that. They tried but, to. Uh, Fuck out of her, dog. It's been 13 years that she, they've been doing it like that. And now she's doesn't have to worry about it anymore. Now she can make her own decisions. I think the headline said Jamie Lee Spears, which is the dad, I believe. And then uh, he thought it said Jamie Lynn, which is Jessica or fucking Britney Spears' little sister. Oh, Jamie Lee. Oh, that's, uh, yeah. So you said Jamie Lee Curtis? <laughs> yeah. The story <laughs> says what he thought it was going to be. <laughs> The story is totally different now. Yeah, this guy, this guy's a nut job. Yeah. Oh, it's funny as fuck. No, hey, but uh, speaking of nut job, yeah, <clears throat> thank God Brittany no longer got them chains. Yeah, uh, and uh, while we're on the free movement, free Haiti, they going Who's through that? it right now. Oh, they, oh, yo, they they going through it right yeah, now, yo. Yeah, I seen that shit. That seven point five earthquake, man. Seven point five earthquake after getting hit by a tropical uh, storm, and then they getting hit by another tropical storm after that. Yeah, they got fucked up, dog. That's then they got tragic. a president assassination. 
Yeah, it's been tough. It's been tough for the Haitian boys out there, for them Zoles out there, man. It's been real tough. I wonder if, like, uh, people so in the Dominican Republic are living their best life. Huh? It was uh-huh. a 7.5 earthquake? I believe so, yeah. Damn. The Richter scale says wasn't... that nine, 9 is the highest. Yeah, yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That That's shit was saying. crazy. I seen a video of people like getting pulled out from like the rubble, like the rubbish dog, like from Damn. under cement, bro. People just like getting pulled out of there. Alive though. Shit's crazy. Now, as far as like I pay attention to the news, I I don't really regular re- that I don't remember them being in earthquake territory. Like them getting too many earthquakes or whatnot, do y'all? It's just 2021, there you don't know what the fuck happening nowadays. Shit's I know they had crazy. a lot of hurricanes, but earthquakes. I they they probably have, but it's probably just not as often. I mean, I guess but, you can't really predict an earthquake, though. If, you know what I'm saying? If the the yeah. I, the shit's moving, it's the earth's natural. moving, nigga. Yeah, that shit happens. Yeah. Do you think the, the the Dominican Republic is getting the same effect, but they're just not getting talked about? Nah. Just, they're attached. Like there's no. no coverage or something. I don't huh? think I don't think it hit Dominican Republic. Nah, nah. That's too. Uh, it's like nah, it's like you'd if hear uh, more Dominicans talking. Yeah, it's about. like hitting hitting North North Dakota, but not South Dakota. It's like hitting Florida and not hitting North Carolina. You know what I'm saying? Like it's it's uh, Georgia. I think that's, Georgia. I think they're pretty close. I think it's like Cuba. Yeah, but like, nigga, one's Cuba's way the, the size fuck of Florida. Yeah, but you think if you get an earthquake at Homestead, you you'll feel that shit in fucking Kendall or Miami. Oh uh, yeah, pro- I don't know. I um, really don't know. I don't think so. I don't know if earthquakes are that big. I don't think so, dog. That's I a good it, I question. Think, I think it happens where it happens, and you that's might feel it. a little vibration, maybe like a tornado. <laughs> yeah, like wherever it happens, that's where it goes down, dog. If a tornado hits Homestead, it's definitely not hitting American Airlines Arena. You know what I'm that, saying? That is an interesting question. How big is an earthquake? Like the radius of an earthquake? It could be up to four, five miles. Oh no. 300 to 400 kilometers. Yeah, and about four or five miles, right? Kilometers, not kilometers, remember? We went oh over goodness. that. Kilometers. Yeah, and yeah. and like like Frankie said, it also depends on the on the magnitude yeah. of the of the thing. But it was a 7.0. So yeah, yeah I'm right. pretty sure it, it was pretty massive. That's interesting though. Man, thank God we don't got to fucking deal with earthquakes, yo. You don't know that, bro. Not until Lizzo steps on the scene. Oh, my nah, goodness. Nah, nah, <laughs> Damn, nice. uh, <laughs> that was yeah. good, that was funny. That was funny. Nah, <laughs> did, did you listen to, to her new single? Uh, I didn't listen to it. Did you listen to it? Yeah, yeah, I care about Lizzo like I care about fucking... Gay people, nigga. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> like, <laughs> it is what it is, though. She dropping music, fantastic. Good I, for her, dog. I, 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 I was, I don't know. I was kind of uh, intrigued. Just feeling that shit. I like that one song. Why man wait till they gotta be great? That's it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, like this one was featuring Cardi B. Mm, and uh, pregnant ass. Yeah, I was telling Frankie this is Cardi B's second flop, consecutive flop. She ended up releasing a single with Armani, many of the Butcher's artists. Mm-hmm. They didn't do too great. This but one is Cardi B that good though? Yeah, she's up there. She's let's, one of the. Uh, she's let's, one of the biggest N- NY artists. Let's flick funk flex hands in the air one time. Like you think <laughs> that motherfucker? You think she's actually that good, or you think it's just because the way she speaks, dirty and shit it's like everything. That? Everything I'm saying, her, her look and all that. Does she spit though? Uh, um, yeah, I think so. I think one she song I did like from her first album, she only had one album, right? Yeah, Invasion that, of Privacy. That, that Pray for Me or Be Careful with Me. So, oh, be like careful. That. Yeah, and, and, some and that, song, shit. that song she didn't even write. Who wrote that shit? A guy wrote it. You see, she'll uh-huh. be spitting. I mean, yeah. The one she be writing, talking about she's sucking dick and shit like that. What's up? She said Offset writing most of her shit. uh, Ah. Now, like, yeah, I mean. Offset be spitting on it. I fuck with Offset. 
Who do you think is is top and why then? Jim Jones. <laughs> nah. I was gonna say that too. <laughs> Nip said. Actually, I I, I want to get your opinion on this song. First take on on rumors. What song is that? The new Lizzo song. Should 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 do you wanna do you wanna wait on the blue? chip? Do you wanna wait on the chip? I don't care. Uh oh. How about how about you start eating the chip and I start playing the song? Nah, it's just gonna be last the whole song. See if you can huh? last the whole I don't song. wanna hear fucking Lizzo all fucking It's pretty bad. Is it's it pretty bad? bad. I I I wasn't impressed. And that's because I I, I, I like Lizzo. I think she's talented. Good place. But hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. In case y'all uh y'all are wondering, we ended up buying this one, one chip. chip challenge, Carolina Reaper and Scorpion Pepper. Scorpion Pepper. Just say oh, inside just one brutal. extremely hot chip, then it say this chip will destroy you. All right, all right. Put some lime on it. Can't put nothing on it, but it is sealed Damn. so the motherfuckers know. You got a beer? Shit, you got a beer yeah, ready? You can't drink nothing. Oh, oh, you going traditional, dog? Okay, I see you. Well, I mean, there's there's shit inside. Let me open this bitch because I know there's shit inside of here that tell you some shit. Like if it's a rule or something. No, uh, let let let, let the camera see. He's unboxing see. it. Oh, I'm just it's opening the fucking shit. thing. Oh bro. damn. <laughs> uh oh. All right, so this is what it looks like. Is uh. So it's at the top. It's all this shit, oh. and then it's this inside what of you. What to know, expect? What the oh, no, yeah, read it, read it, read it. What's it? What's what's say? <clears throat> it says you, a mere mortal who thinks they could have what it takes. The Reaper, one otherworldly demon fueled by the hottest peppers known to man. What to expect? Made with Carolina Reaper and Scorpion Pepper. This is straight from hell. Was created for the sheer pleasure of intense heat and pain. <laughs> Round one, spicy punch. Round two, scorpion sting. Round three, the vision disruptor. <laughs> the round four, the gut slash. And round five, roasted. So, now you're I looking guess, red just, just reading that shit. Yo. I guess it's, I lost my damn breath. Now you gotta read all this goddamn <laughs> shit. <laughs> and it's it's big, dog. Look, it's this big, dog. That doesn't look that that's big. How you it looks like it. a regular that's tortilla how you chip. That's how I like it. It looks like it's a regular a, tortilla chip. Any last words, rules for the challenge. Eat the entire chip, wait as long as possible before drinking or eating anything. Post your reaction on social media with one chip, with hashtag one chip challenge and mention Pocky Chips at P-A-Q-U-I-C-H-I-P-S. All right, are you let's nervous? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nah. Are you, you're not nervous? I don't know. Are you just going to eat it all in one shot? I mean, that's what you're supposed to do, right? All right, all right. All right, so the smell's not that bad. Ah, you, you are ruthless for that. This is like a shit. Nah, yeah. That should look like a piece of jerky. That should look like some fucking carne asada right there, bro. That should look like a piece of Mars. Ooh. So this is what the pack inside the pack look like. Okay, 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 okay. Pepper. Oh, you got to eat that little piece too. Ah! 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 Mmm, boy. It's hot. It's not hot. You no, know, it's hot. My lips are burning where it touched right here. It's hot, bro. Just don't touch your eyes. Woo. I'm going to play you some of this, though. Ooh. A few moments later. Ozzy, are you all right? Yeah, bro, but... Oof. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, bro. A few moments later. Uh, in one of the comments, it says that it feels like you're licking Satan's asshole. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Spicy. <laughs> Is there anything like their other products? No. 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 All right. A few moments later. 
Yeah, so this is accurate, right? What, what, yeah, like, what, what was the most accurate thing? Everything. Because, look, <laughs> at first, I got the spicy punch for sure. It was hot. Remember when I, when I was chewing, I was like, yeah, it's hot. Uh-huh. <laughs> then I swallow it and that fucking scorpion was just fucking stinging my tongue dog oh my gosh and then my eyes started getting watery bro like when I went to the restroom to put my tongue in the faucet <laughs> <laughs> I, my eyes were crying bro <laughs> Couldn't see uh, my eyes were like red as fuck. No, no, no. Yo, the same shit happened to me yesterday. I'm a fucking retard. I I had like my my modelo and I had tahin and everything on it. I accidentally put it on my shirt. I seen I I, I had tahin and salt on my shirt. I'm a fucking dumbass. I look. I'm like, oh shit. I brush it up right into my fucking <laughs> eye, and like my eye is just on fire for like two minutes. And um, yeah, it got to the point where it like felt numb, but I mean, um, I'm good right now. Yeah, I have to try this shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh man, that that's wild. Well, I'm gonna put the link in the description for this chip, <laughs> so you can give it a try as well. Cause that 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 shit's crazy. There's one that costs fifty bucks. But lucky your boy ended up finding the one. It only cost seven dollars. It's called the one chip challenge. Oh man. I'm I think next next episode we're gonna get her done. Do it, dog. Destroyed me. <laughs> I was gonna put that destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like, I mean you did the challenge, right? Yeah. You succeeded. Like oh, no. there wasn't there wasn't like a certain like you had to wait a minute before you no. started drinking. So wait as long as you can. You're like, I'm useless right now. <laughs> Bro, my mouth feels numb. <laughs> I just got fucking raped, bro. <laughs> Oh man, you just ate the exorcist cooch. Oh, I wish I did. No, I'm not doing <laughs> A few moments later. Yeah, you see, now I feel good, bro. Now I feel better, bro. Cause I hope so. You damn near took the whole box of popsicles. Were you prepared Look at for all this shit, situation? bro? Look at this shit. No, bro. <laughs> I'd eat all my kids' popsicles. <laughs> <laughs> what a savage. <laughs> But now oh, man. it's gone. It feels like it's hot, but it's like not like excruciating. Excru it was, it was bad, bro. Oh, man. My eyes were bloodshot, nigga. Oh, I couldn't man. see. I couldn't see because my eyes were crying. These eyes, these <laughs> eyes. I see a lot of things, but never gonna. Bro, crying, bro. All right, so yeah, uh, <laughs> Liverpool fans were uh, in the. In, in the in the stands, chanting "Rent Boy" at Billy G Gilmore. Uh, rent Rent Boy is apparently a, a offensive homophobic slur. That uh, I guess that's what they call uh, uh, male prostitutes that go for that rent themselves out to other men, and that's what Rent Boy is. So like they were chant they were chanting "Rent Boy" and everything. Uh, yeah. That's funny as fuck. I don't know how to, funny that is, but that's that's unfortunate for the dude that was being called that. On to less rent boy news. Football <laughs> preseason starts, and uh, you think that's rent boy? I don't think that's rent boy. Yeah. Oh, Ooh. preseason rent boy. Nah. Feels like it. Feels like you seen the scores to these games. Yeah, that's it. But it's all right. Can't expect much from preseason. When Dolphin play? They played yesterday. They played yesterday. They lost. They Justin, lost. Justin Fields look good too. The Cowboys lost their first two preseason games. We had two already. Oh yeah, we did. Yeah. We went against the Steelers. 
Damn. We, we lost. Is that considered a preseason game? Yeah, Hall of Fame game. Oh, wow. Hey. Damn, we lost two already. So I feel, I feel normal now. So from whenever the fuck I ate this, now I feel good. After we started talking about football, huh? Oh, shit. Dogs? It's already 2 o'clock. What is yeah, that? We, we got to get through there, yo. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to say. It, 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 any games y'all looking forward to today? There's only one game today, so yeah, the only game. Which one? The one that's on at one o'clock. Which one? <laughs> I don't know. I don't Colts know. and the uh, Panthers. The Colts and the Panthers. That's right, baby. Yeah, it was three, Cowboys three, going three. to the Super Bowl. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Dolphins suck. Uh, All right, Chris. That's cool. <laughs> you heard the thing. <laughs> Arrow Spence no longer fighting Manny Pacquiao. Yeah, that's why. Because Arrow Spence got a hurt retinia, a tore retinia or something. He was scared. He's scared to fight Pacquiao, boy. He's scared to fat fight Pacquiao. Pacquiao's supposed to retire after this, apparently. I never called Edward to discuss this, but whatever. Um, Jake Paul's hit list. Jake Paul got Canelo and his hit list that he wants to go against him. Eventually, who else, who else he got in his hit list? Frank, uh, Frankie, McGregor, Kamar Usman, either or of the Diaz brothers. Uh, he put Javante Davis on there. Did I say McGregor? Yeah. Uh, and he had his brother at the end of the list. Any any of those fights you're looking forward to, Ozzy? No. Fuck Jake Paul. Yeah, I don't. He's not. No, nigga. Who would you what want if him I was to a... fight though? Yeah. Huh? Who would you want him to fight though? Well, I don't want him to fight anybody. I want, I want, I don't want him to just stop. I mean, he's fighting people, old people, and shit like that. If he fights Javante Davis, Javante Davis is gonna fuck him up. He fights Canelo, Canelo's gonna fuck him up. That's what I'm saying. You gonna want to watch that fight? I'm gonna watch it regardless, man. <laughs> so you will be what? entertained. Yeah, it's gonna be. So I'm you be would want to see it. No. <laughs> I, like, I what, 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 I'm, what, what, I'm on a podcast, bro. I gotta watch it. What if I was to tell you that uh he's being trained by uh Floyd Mayweather? Oh fuck Floyd, fuck Floyd Mayweather. Oh yeah? And his fucking daddy. I mean he's one of the all time greats though. Floyd Mayweather? Fuck. Well, fuck, fuck I mean Mayweather. I I think I don't know, it's gonna be interesting. Then again, Floyd Mayweather he Floyd Mayweather trained a lot of people and they weren't successful. But well, some of them were. I don't know. Uh and then uh last but not Davis least. All right. Yeah, last but not least, uh Nico Ali Wash, grandson of Muhammad Ali, ended up winning in his first debut fight. You and uh out, right? and a first TKO, first round TKO. No. Why are you looking like that, Frankie? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh yeah did, did y'all see that that little that yeah, little so fight? i seen that little clip yeah well i didn't see the fight but i see the clip and i seen him he caught his ass yeah his right hand that was that was that was pretty clean but yeah, i heard but, like i heard uh, the competition wasn't fair yeah that nigga looked garbage whoever he was fighting then he had but he had the everlast shorts on and right. he did the Muhammad Ali pose and shit like that if he knocked out a fucking legend, and that nigga just knocked out somebody who just came from the corner <laughs> store. <laughs> no, but I heard I heard Muhammad Ali's first fight wasn't all that great either. Like, is anybody's first fight really great? Right, that's what I'm saying. Like, for right mm. now, the legacy stands. Like, yeah, yeah, they made like, a, they the made a big deal about it because it's his grandkid, which is which is dope. You know what I mean? And, and it is pretty impressive. Like your first fight, your first debut fight, you get a TKO. Like, it doesn't yeah. happen often. And, nah, that's oh man, him wearing them trunks that that, that shit had me hype. I don't really? even know why. Yeah, that that's like they said that he got it. He got it passed down once he turned like twenty one or something like that. And I just imagine they kept it in a box or something. And then first time he puts it on is in that fight. Everybody, everybody will pay like millions and millions of dollars to have that those trunks. And he and has now they're, now they're worthless. <laughs> I mean, he probably devalued it right now, but if he continues with with the uh like winning with the winning streak, I think it's gonna continue rising in price. 
And it will eventually get up there. Or that they get knocked out his next three fights, though. Dang. They probably still would get worth money. Be like it, man. Yeah. I just thought that was interesting. Muhammad Ali's grandson. Now, like, first it was Muhammad Ali's daughter. Now the grandson. Now mm-hmm. he's, he's stamped in, in, in fucking boxing legacy. But Walsh. I mean, I, I ain't, got, I, I, I ain't the person to tell everybody that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, anything else to tell the people? Because we got a lot. We, we got a lot of plans. Yeah, go school shopping or like wash your hands and wash your ass. Because y'all motherfuckers over there in Florida fucking dirty as fuck. That motherfucking COVID and shit. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. You think it's just Florida? I know it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Frankie. Stay cool, be smooth. Have a good week. That's it. And Frank Frankie's gonna have better internet next next episode. <laughs> I don't yeah, know what sorry. happened. Next episode sorry. when he eats the chip. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna be cutting in and out. Y'all gotta swallow it. Y'all can't spit it out. Damn, I bro. What you think? I don't give a you fuck. You think we a rant boy over here uh, or what? Fuck. Y'all niggas what need to swallow that shit. Because I know you y'all niggas will start chewing the shit. I swallowed it, bro. <laughs> I get it, dog. And I stayed for like 10 seconds. You, you, got, you gotta, you gotta you check how long did. I stayed sitting down, bro. Because I know it was like five seconds, 10 seconds. To that shit. That shit was hot as fuck. We got you next episode. I, I'll, I'll probably oh. even send one to, to Rachel. Don't send me shit. Oh yeah, and, and Rachel probably won't be on the next episode. Like if whenever we do get the setup in the studio, like it probably she'll probably be behind the scenes, still in the show, but she doesn't feel comfortable herself being in front of the camera. Why she got a hit out on for her? Yeah, yeah. So, something like that. Something so, like that. <clears throat> so we finna get up out of here. I want to think in every. I want to think in. I want to thank each and every one of y'all for listening. Thank you, Ozzy, for being a champ and a soldier for devouring that fucking chip from Mars. That shit looked crazy. That shit did like a piece of Mars, huh? Oh, man. Uh, she almost made me see the stars, nigga. Shit. And thank you, thank you, Frankie, for just being awesome, dog. I don't even know what you did today. <laughs> thank you for not getting locked up and playing, about? keeping it smooth and shit. Um, but yeah, uh, we'll catch y'all next time. Peace in the Middle East. Let it rain in Spain. Have a good fucking week, y'all. We out. Boom. Damn, I hit my elbow right now. <laughs>